Good morning, everyone. Hey, Chloe. Today is Chloe's first day of school, of kindergarten, and everyone is super excited for her. Chloe's been really excited. She's been ready. It's 8 o'clock. Today is their first day, so it's a half day for the littles. And they're only going to do um, half a day. So I'm going to drop her off. She's got a present for her teacher. It's dress down day, so no uniforms today. But she is super excited. I'm off today. I took today off. Um, well, first of all, I had a free PTO day. Second of all, it's her first day of school, so I wanted to be off for that. And then I also have quite a bit of things to get done today in my off day. So it's going to be a busy day for me. I've got someone coming to look at my kitchen to do, um, they're going to paint my, my cabinets and stuff. When they finally come in, they are still delayed, you guys. And then I've got, um, to go take the dog to get her um, booster shots and to get her nails cut and I've got to go run a few errands for the house but yeah I'm gonna take you guys with me so um, I'm not gonna take my camera into the school I'm sure I can't record in there I'm gonna take some pictures on my phone when I drop her off and I will see you guys soon you ready baby mm -hmm. are you excited no. Are you not, you're not excited? You told me you were excited. No, I wasn't. You look at your unicorn book bag. And my unicorn lunch bag. And your unicorn lunch bag. You ready? No. She says no, but she's ready. Oh my goodness, you guys, that was a little chaotic, but at the same time, it was well organized, if that makes any sense. It's because, like, they, they told us at orientation via email and everything else, when you're dropping off your kids, they want you to use a certain entrance because there's two entrances and they don't want to hold up traffic. But of course, you had those non listening parents still going down the wrong road. So, Anyways, um, I thought it was going to be chaotic to get out, but it was actually quite easy. Um, the only chaos was the people coming the wrong way were blocking others from getting out effectively, so they couldn't see, like, when to turn. But anyways, um, Chloe did great. She did not cry. There was one little boy in the class next to her crying outside the door. But um, she gave her teacher an apple. That was the little present she had wrapped up. And... Um, yeah, she went on in the classroom, so I took a couple pictures real quick, and she's got her crowns so that we're going to go color. I know she's excited about that. Um, then my mom just called me like, Luna is already out of food. And I'm like, why do you guys wait? I have the dog food on Amazon auto ship, but since I just got her bag last week, I set it to ship out the first week of September. So now I have to go get a bag in the meantime. And I mean, she's eating twice a day. And we're definitely not overfeeding her, but hold on. They are really going to drive me crazy today. That was my mom to let me know Luna's also pulling up my solar lights in the yard and chewing on them. So anyways, I'm heading to PetSmart to get another bag of dog food for Luna. I've got to watch and, and see like, I know, I thought Cristiano, and he may be was giving her like good enough portions like not to overfeed her or anything but I did give her a smaller bag to try her out on the food but still it was like enough where I mean maybe I guess maybe two meals a day but that still seems really quick for the food to be gone a week a week later she's got like enough for one more bowl today so I don't know I'll check it out when I get home but I'm gonna what was that I'm gonna head into PetSmart now. I think I might have some points too. Oh, and I forgot PetSmart does afterpay. Oh my god, you guys. That is also another great thing. Like when I went last time to get her um all of her stuff, like well no, when I got the crate and stuff, I didn't use it. But when I went back and got cookies grooming and stuff, I did use afterpay there, so that was awesome. Why does PetSmart not open until 9? I need to be back at the house at 9.30 so the person coming to look at my cabinets can do what they need to do. Luckily, I don't live that far. <clears throat> and it's like three minutes till they open, four minutes till they open. So I'm going to get out, grab the food, run back to the house. 
wig on this guy. They can look at the cabinets. And then, oh, I have a Walmart order coming. My groceries are, are being delivered around 10. And then I'll need to head back out shortly after that to get Chloe. I need to check on the status of my cabinet doors. I need to see if Cristiano's allergy meds are ready. And, oh, then I have someone coming over later today also to check, like, to look at the gutters and stuff outside. Like, they're going to clean my gutters and fix some of the vinyl siding. And, yeah, like I said, full day. Full day, you guys. Stay tuned to see how my baby dig in school. I'll probably see you before I get there, but... I'm so curious to see how she did on her first day. I'm so proud of her. It is right at 11. It's time to pick up Chloe. I can't wait to hear about her first day. I'm in the car line. It's, it's expected to be a long line. Um, I think the first week they're going to be checking IDs and everything. So I just put my little name tag up here in the front window so they can write her name down. And then like further up the line, they're going to check IDs. I can't wait to hear all about her day. I got Gigi in the back with me. We're picking her up. I like how they put their kids' names in the window. <laughs> in the window. I'm gonna show you real quick the line. You probably can't see it too good from here. So where I'm at, it like loops around the building and then comes back up and out. I'm gonna show you real quick. So the line goes all the way down there, back up and around and back out. School at uh, <laughs> a kindergarten. You did so good. How was your first day? Good. I was drawing. It was so good. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of you. You were drawing? Yeah, we didn't have to do any homework. No homework today? Did yeah. you Did you make a lot of friends? Well, no, I just made one. You made one friend? Yeah. What's their name? I don't know what her name is. <laughs> it was a little girl? Yeah. Well, that's good. I'm so glad, but you had a good day? Yeah. You got your lunchbox too? Uh, yeah. Okay, perfect. Did you have your, look at these people, get over. Did you have your snack? Yeah, I Good. There was a trash can in the right next to the door, and I threw it in there. You did. Can I take this off? Yeah. She said, "Don't take Aww. it off." Oh. Because she wanted me to put the, the, this on so the teachers know my name. <laughs> Oh my goodness, look at my gift. My first day. She drew me a a lollipop. Is it a grape lollipop? I got a, no, it's not a great What color. flavor is it? I don't know. So cute. Thank you, baby. All right, you guys. While I was gone, they dropped off my Walmart order. So I just came in with Chloe, and um, I put the... I'll show you guys what I brought. It's like a um, mat for the car that I can transport the dogs on. So they don't, like, mess up the seats. And I'll try to link it down below because it's really nice. I got it from Amazon. It's really affordable, really nice. Um, but I'm I just put that in the car, came in, and I'm making some spaghetti and some garlic knots for lunch. And after we eat, Cristiano's going to go with me to the um, clinic where we're going to have uh, Luna Spade. And I'm going to drop off her medical stuff so they can actually update her. <clears throat> Excuse me. Update her booster shots. And I'm going to try to get those nails filed while we're there. And then I'll come back because... Then I have someone coming to look at the gutters and doing some other work at the house. But anyways, look at this. I um, got my pasta going, my meat. Um, they didn't have the one I wanted, but I got this. It's all good. It was still the same brand. I wanted chunky this time. And then I got these garlic knots, which you can put, you can bake them in the oven right in this bag. You just make a couple small holes like I did and bake them for about 10 minutes at 375. And that's going to be our lunch. Luna, have a seat. You guys, this is the car seat cover that I got for the dog. Like, it has this mesh part here where like, you can unzip it if you want to, like, hand them treats and stuff. And it's kind of, like, covering where Chloe's car seat is, but it's all good. Sorry, I'm going to show you Luna's butt. But uh, Luna said I've got her hooked up right there to the harness. And it's really nice. It's waterproof. You ready, girl? Sit. Luna, sit. Sit. <laughs> sit. She can't break free like she wants to. Cristiano ended up having to get back here in the back with Luna because even though she is hooked up, she somehow managed to jump over the back into the trunk 